Good, Good morning. morning from the ocean. Yep. So the plans right now are to go to the main dining room for breakfast mm. because we want to see what that's about. And then the gym for our daily workout. Uh, and then there's all sorts of activities that we may or may not get up to, as Jay likes true. to say. You never know. We have two sea days to get yeah. back to Floridia, so. But we, you will see what we do. Yeah, yeah come <laughs> on. Well, welcome to Grand Cuvée on deck three, at the bottom level. Afternoon. It is. It's before dinner. Yeah. After lunch. <laughs> we've, we've missed lunch. We took a nice little work day today. You know, yeah. with two sea days down, mm -hmm. we take a lot of down time. Now, it was busy. We could have logged ourselves sitting here punching buttons on the computer Making and all sorts of interesting calls. things like that. You don't want to see that. No. So now we're ready to hop out for some fun stuff, mm -hmm. which is going to involve a snack. Yeah, we're um, so hungry. No lunch till Brooklyn. And then we got live tunes happening. We got dinner coming up. There's Captain's a show cocktail tonight. party. Yeah, there's there's quite a few things tonight. There's yeah. a Latin dance party like. Oh gosh. I'm excited for that. Yeah, we can't commit to all that. Okay? Yeah, we're doing all that. Don't hold us responsible. We're going if we all don't. that. <laughs> all right, let's go. All right. Let's see what we're working with here at the cafe. And now Ensemble Lounge. Oh, I hear piano tunes. Oh, fun. I know the string duo is back in here tonight. Yeah, I didn't see this on the schedule. I think it is just a guest who is chilling and playing the piano. That's awesome. Rhapsody of Blue. Oh my god, that's out of my element. Oh wow, oh, no. she's taking requests. We got oh, some muffins, <laughs> peanut butter cookies. This is karaoke for D. Broadway karaoke. <laughs> well, our guest entertainer has retired, so now we're hanging out until the Sea Breeze Duo. <laughs> for Grand Cuvée.
we are done with dinner and now it's time to head to the sky. Oh, we're into Quasar. It's pre-recorded music hour. Y'all, this is some swanky, swanky music. <laughs> well, our short-lived dancing career is over. All right, now time to head to the sky. Well, there looks like there is no line here at the Sky Lounge yet. This is the Elite Senior Officers event. Well, the doors have opened. Let's come on down. Well, I grabbed an apple teeny. Dee has gone for some champagne. And now we're in for some tunes. started with the snacks. I grabbed one of every type on the first tray. We've got like a fig deal, a salmon deal, and a brie cheese. for the night. So let's have our wrap up, shall we? We shall. Uh, now, we have to admit, we did not complete the list of tasks that we thought we were going no. to complete. <laughs> you know, sometimes these things just happen and I always say this is why we don't make plans. I mean, but. we have good intentions. They just don't always work out. Like just, work gets in the way that's or true. needing sleep, things like that. Yeah. Silly things All like that. Things, yeah. To just know that there was a production show tonight, which We've we seen have seen before. Twice. Yep. And it's very good. And um, a Latin party that Which, went like this. Do, do, well, do, 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 do. It was that. outside and it was woo, well, rocky and windy and stuff, so it just wasn't really a good idea. Yeah. Let's go ahead and jump into mm -hmm. dinner. Or do we need to talk about, we did the captain's party. We did some random stuff. Yeah, that's always a good time. You saw all that stuff though, didn't you? You saw it. All right, <laughs> dinner time. You did the salmon rillette. This is amazing. It's kind of like, I don't know. What would you call it? It's not a pate. No, it's like salmon. I think there's probably mayonnaise in it. I'm probably. not sure. Uh, some caviar, or, you know. Is it like a caviar. mousse? I'm trying to think of a word Maybe. like what is a rillette. I don't know. There's like a hard boiled egg on it. It has such good flavor though. I don't know how to describe it though other than yummy. Hey, that's the perfect <laughs> way to do it. Now, 
Funny thing tonight is, if you were playing the Who's Gonna Eat What game, I actually let D select all my appetizers and entrees tonight. He was not inspired. Um, I was like, I don't even know what I want, and she picked everything. So I had escargot. They were actually really good. Yeah, I gave they were. you one. They yeah. were super tender, not chewy at all, mm -hmm. delicious little buttery garlickiness. I sopped it all up with bread. <laughs> so I approve of that. It was tasty. That was that was fantastic. Yeah. I also am the only one who got a second appetizer, which well, was that's right. Kale salad. It's got pumpkin. It's got cherries. It has other stuff. Nuts, I think. You know what's not on this salad? Blue cheese. Blue cheese. I was trying to get you some roughage. Mm, yeah. You're welcome. Uh, but you know what I discovered is that cherries in a salad are delicious, mm. and I really enjoyed it. Yeah. So what can it's I good. say? Yep. And kale, it just scraped its way right down my throat. Just, <laughs> it's just any... Yeah, it's nice. Cool. Clear you right out. You had duck a la orange. I did. This portion was huge. It was like two like leg quarters basically yeah um and then like lots of orange sauce because that's what the whole plate looks like <laughs> there were some potatoes under there and some green beans it was cooked really well the skin was crispy it didn't have that livery taste like sometimes you can get oh, with the, duck the breast which especially. i'm always nervous to order duck because i hate that but um yeah it was delicious mm. and i had here's the entree she picked out for me mushroom risotto yeah it was pretty good. I gotta say, it didn't feel like it was prepared in a true risotto style in that there were still some almost crunchy bits in there, I'm but sorry. in general, now you didn't cook it. That's true. It needed true. a little more bubbling and a little more stirring, a little more time, I think. But, I mean, the flavor was good. It was just very toothsome, and that's not mm -hmm. what I usually expect in my risotto. But risottos are hard to make. They are. I appreciate that. Yeah. For dessert, you got the citrus roulade. This is good. It's like lemony and like raspberry, I think, mm. kind of jellyish stuff in there. It's very, um, like, like tangy. Tangy, yeah. yeah. I'm like acidic. No, that's not I'm trying right. to remember what you said to me it at the table. Tangy. You were like, this is tangy. It is, but it was good. It's dang tangy. Might need ice cream to cut it, though. Speaking of, I had baked Alaska, <laughs> which is essentially ice cream and cake and meringue. There and you go. This version is pretty good. It does not have like the crunchy crystallized sugar, mm. which I don't really like the crystallized sugar. So I like this meringue style, but it was, this is not my favorite. I don't know. I can't oh. explain why. It was good. I'll if you like ice cream, why you don't like it. I just not that I don't like it. I just don't know how to explain why I don't have rave reviews of it. I did a terrible job picking out food for you. <laughs> well, now granted, I chose the baked Alaska. Yeah, I was like, wait. So I, I did select that on my own. I was going to pick that for you anyway. Overall decent. Decent. So now stay tuned because this video is not over. We're going to no. roll right into our very last C day, mm -hmm. lumping them on together because, you know, we're taking it easy, doing lots of work yeah. and just blah, blah. So here comes See another ya. day. <laughs> Bye. Bye. And now it's Ocean View Cafe time. We have got a veritable smorgasbord of goodness. We've come to the Grand Foyer now for the Egg Drop Challenge. You see they're setting up some plastic cling wrap down there to kind of protect the floor. They'll collect their eggs and head up to Sushi on Five. So we got a two-story drop today. <laughs> now I did the sign up to serve the morning, and I gave them 24 hours to move these devices together. Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Okay. okay. Yes, the egg. Side now. Oh, they do have all these cute little chairs. If the wind doesn't blow us away, it was raining earlier this morning, but the sun has come out. Looking good. How's this look? <laughs> well, 
these lounge chairs make me think of the Titanic? Well, they look cozy. Maybe it's the ones down here that keep giving me the Titanic vibe. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, it is actually slightly chilly out here, but I have to say, I love it. This is just the weather I need. Good evening. Good evening. Much, 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 much later. Yeah. A lot of packing has ensued. A lot of working has ensued. I don't know who we are packing this early in the day. That's I just didn't want to have to deal do. with it later, honestly. So That's just like, let's true. get it done. Yeah, and we have to be out of the cabins by 7.30 tomorrow morning, as yeah. a side note. So I'm like, uh-uh, I'm going to make sure I get all my stuff <laughs> packed today. But anyway, we're going to have dinner in the MDR. Starving. Um, there's a show tonight, like yeah. a Broadway singing review show. Mm -hmm. I love those, yeah. Stuff will happen. So let's go and see it. Let's we're go do moving it. moving a lot, actually. It's we're, really, there's like a big storm somewhere by Florida, apparently. Yeah, just sitting here rocking back and forth. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> roll out. Bye. <laughs> Bonjour, Grand Cuvée. Come out to the Grand Foyer now to catch a little bit of Leslie McDonald's performance as well as the Officer's Farewell Soiree. Theater, they're doing the perfect pair okay. game so show out here at Celebrity Central. I ask, which item from a fast food restaurant will you use to describe your wife's chesticles? Anyway, we are up here for the intimate Broadway cabaret show. Well, we were the first in line, so I think we've got our pick of seats. That's right, we'll be right here in our favorite back row. Woohoo! Oh my gosh, I can't even sit in the theater and I get bombarded with it. Help! But it's a nice video. All right, we'll watch the nice video. I can almost forgive this because it's very cute. Almost. Superstar singers and orchestras, start the clapping, start the cheering, because it's time that we took you back to Broadway!
officers and crew, thank you so much for choosing Celebrity Cruises for your cruise vacation. But more importantly, thank you so much for trusting us with your cruise vacation. Until we meet again, we'll see you real soon. Bye bye! Good night. Welcome to the cabin. Time for bed. Mm -hmm. So I guess let's wrap it up. Uh, we went to the uh, event in the foyer, but we had terrible seats, which is fine. Heard we a couple of songs. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the uh, captain and officers came out and did some speakings. Couldn't see them. Recorded a couple of the songs. Showed you the floor. Good times. <laughs> uh, let's. We're bypassing dinner, obviously, till the end. Yeah. Um, so the show, Broadway Cabaret. So good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Such an amazing, talented group of singers. I know we've had the the one gentleman who mm -hmm. sang an Elvis song before on another ship, and I remembered he was really good. But yeah. um, yeah, I love the song choices they had. The dancing was really exceptional too. Have we seen bits and pieces of that show like similarly, similarly? On a oh my gosh, sim similarly. <laughs> That's a really hard word to say. On a different ship, yeah. Yeah, right. but they get to put their own spin on it with some of the songs, so yeah. that was really good. And I like that it trended to more modern songs. Me too. I would say I yeah. always love when you know it, the classic Broadway shows are great, but sing me some songs that I know and love, and they did. They did, yeah. They delivered for sure. You know, let's deliver on some dinner dishes. <laughs> so there we are. Hey, now you got another shrimp cocktail. What's the shrimp cocktail update? Yeah, I had to give it another chance this one was much better okay so. Woo. not mealy <laughs> no not at all cook to perfection good. Cook. Right. <laughs> it was good i got squash soup now mm -hmm. This is what you would expect, squash soup. It's a little sweet, but not too sweet. If you've ever had, I don't know what kind of squash, like a butternut squash or something like that. Mm -hmm. It had a dollop of, oh, it was an apple. Yeah. I was digging it out of there and I was like, is this creme fraiche? Cause you know, any white thing in a soup, I'm thinking it's creme fraiche. Apple and <laughs> crunchy nuts in there. And it came together pretty well. Just a little sweet. Again, like having a, a slight dessert for nice. your appetizer. There is what we both got, which is a cob salad. I picked this because there was no blue cheese in it because it was cheddar cheese but then they were like here's the dressing and it was Surprise, blue, cheese. blue cheese which I made me happy else, but it was it wasn't overly powerful it yeah. was really good now yeah because to me it was a very mild <laughs> blue cheese flavor but you were like mm, i taste it yeah i'm a blue cheese boy what can i say there's your prime rib this was very good um i would have liked it with a baked potato instead of the mashed mm. potatoes i guess i could have asked but the mm. flavor was really good. It was cooked perfectly. Nice. I, went, I say this about everything. You went medium. The vegetables yeah. were al dente. <gasps> were they? Really, really yummy. <laughs> everything was nice. That's amazing. <laughs> Speaking of really yummy, I've had this dish before, but I decided to go out on a limb again and get the chicken chiquita. Now just look at it. It's a fried chicken breast. It has ham, cheese, and bananas stuffed inside of it, and it comes with coconut rice. Now, none of that sounds like it's going to be delicious in any form of any world, but it's very mild combination. You basically get that whole sort of cordon bleu cheesy hammy yeah. experience with just a little sweetness from the bananas. It comes together really well. So I had kind of forgotten about it, decided to try it again. I like it. <laughs> I might get it a lot. Yeah. Let's jump to dessert. Uh, there is your sticky toffee pudding. This was the Fit Fair dessert because it had like, like puff cereal on top, I guess is what they called nice. it. With a piece of banana and pineapple. It was really good. Not like a rich, moist kind of like toffee pudding you'd be expecting. It's probably like full calories, mm. but they did a good job. Yeah. Now I'm gonna have to jump back. I got the, let me read it, oh blackberry anise nougat glacé, which was a fancy word for this um, sort of moussey little cake. Now I actually got what, the sugar-free option, I yes. think it was, yeah. And it had blackberries on top. Now those blackberries, they had been soaking in some anise, see I used to say anise, but I think people yeah. have said it's anise, flavor, which is licorice flavor. So the primary flavor of the whole flavor was licorice. But you like licorice. I like to torture myself with licorice flavors. I never liked black licorice much, but I... You like like green drinks uh -huh, that taste like uh, black licorice on certain other cruise lines. Yeah, <laughs> but it was okay. Would yeah. I get it again? Nah, I'm oh. done with that one. But I mean, for a no sugar added dessert, if you like licorice, give it a try. Me, I'm done with it. It's okay. The more you know. That's true. And then we both got banana rum ice cream, which was so rummy. It was so. It was a perfect oh. accompaniment to the toffee pudding too. It yeah, was. it was good. That's it, y'all. So it is bedtime. Actually, we're getting ready to finish packing. I'm gonna go talk about a shower. So stay tuned <laughs> for that. And then debarkation morning is coming up Aww. next. It's been a good ten days. It's gonna be an early morning tomorrow too, yes. kinda. But yeah. anyway, see y'all in it. See you guys tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Bye. 
And now it is time for In the Shower with Jay, Celebrity Silhouette Edition. So this is a standard sort of glass door type unit with not one, or a little loud, but two sliding doors that close in the middle. But look at the shape of this thing. It's like a fluffy friendly rectangle. Every time I pass my hand in front, um, it loses the focus. Fluffy friendly rectangle, I would say. You've got a little shavy bar or a salami hanging rack down at the bottom. Nice big snack shelf. That is amazing. Uh, we got the on off to the left, temperature controls to the right, clearly marked with blue and red arrows. Shower gel, shampoo, conditioner that are all separate, little grab bar. Now here's where it starts to be weird. The shower, nozzle, great. Water pressure, good, different settings. Not detachable, I do miss that. Also, no clothesline, but a couple of little hangy pegs. Uh, and that is it, in a nutshell. So, I guess let's get in here. Now I'll leave these glass doors open to try to eliminate some echo because it is very echoey in here, but overall I have not had a bad time with this shower. There's lots of like side to side room. The front and back room is okay and of course you know when you turn in this direction it gets a little snug. The shower height is good, or shower head height I should say, and I'm 6'5". It adjusts, it twists, it does things, so pretty pleased with this glass box that I've been showering in all week. So let's go into the spreadsheet, find a number. There it is. Good, Good morning. morning from the Florida. I think we're back. We think. <laughs> right, we're going to head to the Tuscan Lounge, mm -hmm. which is our meeting point for departure, and hopefully they have some coffee and some pastries and snacky things. And hit the road. That's true, because you all see I got Embarkation Day <laughs> shirt on again, because Debarkation Day is Embarkation Day. Most so of the time. Yeah. Another adventure is coming. Yeah. But I guess, um, are we doing any final thoughts or do we just say bye? What's our final no, thoughts no. on this we, cruise? No, no. Celebrity is definitely one of our favorite cruise lines oh, and yeah. this cruise, you know, proved that again. Um, the only thing I will say, like negative wise, is that the lack of options in the dining room. It's, it's not like it's they're very not noticeable. there. It's, it's all good. But like, it's like, not like as creative as it used to be. I don't know. It's a lot of soups and it seems yeah. like it's more static items and less things that change each mm. night. But the food is really good. Yeah. And the service is exceptional. The room, this was an amazing room for 10 nights yeah, and plenty of storage. The bed was super comfy. The Wi-Fi was great yeah. for work. Um, the ports were really cool to go to and check out. I don't know, it was a really overall amazing cruise. Yeah, I like the ship overall. Mm -hmm. There's lots of areas that we either didn't go to or only went to once, like the rooftop you or just the can't it's Celebrity it Central <laughs> and the Entertainment Court a little bit. And oh yeah, I do like the quiet areas on the ship. So there's the library, the hideaway, and then um, the Sky Lounge is beautiful for oh, seafood. Yeah. So you have like those areas just to get away and look at the ocean, read a book, you know, it's nice. True that. So yeah. y'all, come on, go see a little silhouette of a ship. Yeah. And as for Dan in the ensemble bar, he is the best. Or we're up in the sky Or we are. Yep. Hey -o. There you go. <laughs> um, but I guess that's it. So we're going to have debarkation uh, morning footage coming up soon. We're going to get back to park by the ports and get the car. Mm -hmm. And that's that. So yeah. if you have not already, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Become a Paromaniac today. Socialize all our media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Yep. And until next time. Right on. on. Let's go. Bye. Hello, Tuscan Grill. Oh, 7.40, we've just gotten clearance. They've got pastries and all the coffees and beverages down here. Yeah, time to join the fray. We're all clear, down the ramp we go. We made it outside, we're just gonna turn to the right and follow the shuttle signs. Oh, I see an orange vehicle here in the lineup of vans. That looks like us, parked by the ports. Made it back to the parking lot and our car is here safe and sound. Woop woop. All right, on to the next.